This is about prejudice. And the language of prejudice. And the power of the language of prejudice. It's called Prejudice, Prejudice, Prejudice. Some boys at school today were making fun because of my hair. I kept on me ginger out of the hands. <laughs> oh, Connor, Connor. There's a lot of red haired kids out there. A lot of great kids. Brian Scalabrini, Connor Connect. With red hair, you have great responsibility. Remember Spider Man? Yeah. <laughs> Spider Man had great responsibility. He had red hair. Great guy. Caught all the bad guys. You'll do fine, Connor. Give me an example of someone I know. This is a story of somebody you know very well. Hey, slide card. More slide. What up, homie? No gingers on the slide. Toyota Shang or the Ginger Ninja. Why did you help me? I thought I was a dirty ginger and nobody liked us. Quite the opposite. Society makes fun of gingers only because they are jealous. They are insolent and want the powers of the fringe with the tinge of the ginger. Wait, we have special powers? For a church. You have a bunch of power so you can use it to beat people that are beating on you. You can fry with your hair or make it ignite in the fire, and you can pick up chicks with those dashing ginger looks. <laughs> really? You can show me how to do all that? Cookies? Oh yeah! Okay then, you may have some cookies if you bake them yourself. What? You must be the ginger you were meant to be. Bake these cookies like a real ginger with a tinge and a little bit of fringe. You was the inner ginger you possessed. Yes! Yo! Ginger! My friend wants to say hi! No ginger ninja for you today. Don't make me do this. <laughs>
year. Only a ginger can call another ginger ginger.